Hey guys, Paul here. Got to speak quietly. Transmitting with an electric condenser mic and an NPN transistor circuit about 20 feet. Let's take a closer look. There's my antenna. The Realtek video dongle. Great for SDR projects and GNU radio companion. You'll hear an echo uh, coming through my laptop speakers because I'm processing this right through the laptop. Again, the transmitter is about 20 feet away. There is the waveform, the FFT Fourier fast transform plot. I'm transmitting right now at uh, 347 megahertz and I'll just show you guys how sensitive that electret mic is so let's take a look at the schematic this schematic is very similar to my previous video transmitting a 555 uh, pulse except here we're using an electret uh, condenser microphone on these, the uh, negative lead is connected to the rim of the microphone. You can see the rim has these uh, soldered lines connecting it off that pin. So you know that that's your negative. And of course, that goes to ground. Um, using 9 volts going into this, I've got a 10K um, resistor. You want to use 1K for every uh, volt of power. Um, otherwise, it's much the same as a traditional NPN oscillating uh, circuit where we've got 4.7K um, interfacing with 10 nanofarads. That's the 102 capacitor. Um, those go from voltage to ground. And on the other side, the 22 nanofarad or the 223 capacitor also connecting voltage into ground. Um, that's where your oscillation is taking place through the base of the NPN. And again, the positive lead out of your microphone is also going into the base. Um, the emitter and collector are bridged together with a 10 picofarad capacitor acting as a feedback capacitor. Uh, the emitter, I have going into a 470 ohm uh, resistor to ground that value can vary you could probably use 360 220 um, i'm using a four turn inductor coil here you can use four to five turns that is going to affect the uh, frequency in megahertz and then your antennas uh, interfacing between the um, inductor and the collector the inductor goes to the positive rail as you can see as well as the tank circuits, um, 10 picofarad capacitor also going to the uh, voltage in. So this is your tank circuit in here. I pretty much haven't changed it up much uh, from my 555 transmitter. So as you're developing this, make sure to keep your oscillation and your uh, feedback capacitor um, and all of that stuff kind of on one side of the of the NPN transistor and then on the other side be interfacing with your audio source and then your circuits gonna work like a charm everything else is pretty standard here um, the inductor coil interfaces with the collector and the other side of that inductor goes to voltage in um, as well as the, the same side uh, interfaces with the antenna um, and the tank circuits capacitor and the other side of the tank circuit capacitor goes to voltage in. Hey you guys thanks for watching subscribe to my channel share this video with your friends and peers who are into RF radio frequency projects and SDR software defined radio post comments below and thanks for watching.